students we are discussing the numericals uh, from the chapter of your thermal expansion solids okay we have discussed the theory in the class and uh, we have started discussing the numericals in today's class uh, we have we were doing sum number 2 you can check it out from your pdfs also okay so how far i have done let me explain it one second till here then i will proceed with the sum okay so what was the second sum c a hole of diameter this the diameter's value is this 0.06 meter all right is bored in an iron plate at the temperature of 25 degrees c bored in an iron plate students means an iron plate is there and you dig out one hole clear this is the term bored means at the temperature of 25 degree c okay that means the iron plate is kept at the temperature of 25 degree c what is the second statement uh, find the temperature to which the plate must be heated in order that a ball of this diameter okay just passes through the hole and the coefficient of linear expansion of iron is being provided in the question okay so yes so what we did till here first let me explain the question so as i told you all that an iron pit is there and you will dig out one hole and the diameter of the hole is this and the plate has been kept at the temperature 25 degrees now what you have been asked in the second part that to which temperature the plate must be heated why so that when it will get heated it will expand and when it will get expand through the hole you can pass one ball of diameter this clear that means how the length of the hole will increase so this is our question okay so let's see so we have to find out what the increase in length okay that was the initial value of the hole this is the new diameter the diameter of the ball okay so the hole must be the length of the hole or the diameter of the hole must be increased by how much so you have to do the subtraction isn't it so see i have done the subtraction it's coming to this all right now what you have been asked you have to find out the temperature so let us assume the temperature to which it is to be heated as t degree c this has to be assumed okay so let's write the formula that i've uh, the formula we have written on top that is the coefficient of linear expansion so write it like this but in the lhs part of the equation students keep your l2 minus l1 part all right you can uh, you can get to know that why we are keeping it in the lhs part so let's write l2 minus l1 equals to l1 into alpha and t2 minus t the way we write why we are writing this because see l2 minus l1's value is given okay so till how far we have written let me explain so this 0.06 is the value of your l1 and alpha's value is 12 into 10 to the power minus 6 you can check out the value of uh, your uh, coefficient of linear expansion of iron okay so l part gone a part alpha part gone into t2 minus t1 t t2 we have assumed it to be as t only that is the temperature to which it is to be heated it means your iron plate okay and your t1's value is 25 degrees c okay so c what is our next part it will be so l2 minus l1 i can write it as this value 0.005 meter isn't it that is that is your l2 minus l1 i'm just writing here also okay so that is your 0.005 Zero zero five equals two, and all other terms that are written on top, that you have to write it again. 
ओके जीरो पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स इंटू ट्वेल्व इंटू टेन टू दी पावर माइनस सिक्स इंटू योर टी माइनस ट्वेंटी फाइव इज इंटेड इज इट क्लियर टू ऑल वाई आई टोल्ड यू ऑल दैट फॉर वन रीजन वी हैव केप्ट दिस एल टू माइनस एल वन इन द एल एच एस पार्ट इज इंट इट सो दैट यू कैन गेट ऑल द टर्म्स विदाउट येस सो दैट यू कैन जस्ट राइट ऑल द वैल्यूज दैट इज बीन प्रोवाइडेड एंड ओनली यू कैन राइट टी माइनस ट्वेंटी फाइव इन सेपरेटली एंड जस्ट वे द वे वी फाइंड वन अन नोन कॉन्स्टेंट दैट वे वी शुड फाइंड आउट ओके सो द नेक्स्ट स्टेप वट इट विल बी आई एम जस्ट राइटिंग टी माइनस ट्वेंटी फाइव इन द लेचेस पार्ट नाउ सो जीरो पॉइंट जीरो जीरो फाइव सॉरी इट विल बी ट्रिपल जीरो फाइव स्टूडेंट्स ट्रिपल जीरो फाइव रिपीटिंग वन सेकेंड योर एल टू माइनस एल वन वैल्यू इज सी आई हैव रिटर्न इट्स जीरो पॉइंट ट्रिपल जीरो फाइव मीटर्स सो प्रीवियसली आई हैड रिटर्न एट जीरो पॉइंट डबल जीरो फाइव आई हैव एडेड वन जीरो सो डोंट मेक मिस्टेक्स इन योर कॉपीज सो जीरो पॉइंट ट्रिपल जीरो फाइव बाई जीरो पॉइंट जीरो सिक्स इंटू ट्वेल्व इंटू टेन टू दी पावर माइनस सिक्स क्लियर सो नाउ जस्ट फाइंड आउट द वैल्यू दिस पॉइंट विल गेट आई थिंक Oh, you can check out the calculation, but I think it should come it as uh, nearly to this seven hundred nineteen point four degree C. Okay, so you should get this value. That is your value of T. Okay. so here are some ends here okay so just let me discuss one second in very short what we did increased the whole should be increased by how much length that we have calculated because the length of the hole is given and the diameter of the ball through which the ball has to be passed through the hole that is given so l2 minus l1 that means the subtraction of this will give you l2 minus l1 that we have calculated and the way the rest of the sums we do generally that we have done